Mr. 445, is it? We have a lot of information about you uh, dating minors, so can you exactly tell me how old your previous girlfriends were? 15, 15, 16, 17, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9. My God. Come over here and kiss me on my hot mouth. I'm feeling romantic. All right, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? We're back again with another YouTube video. So today, uh, EDP finally responded. He finally responded to everything that's going on. So if you guys have no idea what's going on and you haven't watched any of my videos, any of Jideon's videos, any of the big YouTubers, basically EDP was caught again texting a minor and sexting with a minor. And this girl is named Kayla. She came out with her video, uh, I believe a week ago now. And uh, after this video came out, she came out with a bunch of proof, a bunch of evidence, um, you know, stuff like that. And then... Recently, we found out that Gideon actually did a sting operation, but it wasn't really a sting operation. It was a more of a confront him at his dialysis center with all the DMs and messages because Kayla actually knows Gideon and they're working together in this court case. Um, but a lot of people are thinking Gideon actually was using her to set EDP up, which just isn't true. She got groomed and then went to Gideon for help. And then Gideon decided to, with that information, go set him up. Uh, Gideon did not purposely use her to try to catch EDP. I think that a lot of people are confused about that. But basically, recently, he got confronted on his live stream by one of his friends and he, his friend was pretty much pleading with him just to admit to everything just to finish this off because he sees EDP as just a lost cause at this point. 23,000. 23,000 people aren't going to go to your website and wait for a video, Brian. Any will. You can do it right now on your own platform or your video on your website is going to get posted everywhere else by other people. And of course, does EDP admit to anything? No, he throws a fit and then says he's going to address it on his uh, on his website. So a day passed, we were waiting, and then he finally uploaded a video on his website. And it's called Gideon is a Clown Ass Bitch. So as you guys can tell by the title, he literally doesn't own up to anything. He bends everything again like he's used to. And of course, he couldn't talk about this on his live stream. He has to go to a safety net that is his website where he feels safe to talk shit. Um, you know, disconnected from all of reality. So I'm not really going to play the video like I normally do. Usually I'll play it and then react to it because I do think this is just a genuinely sad video. It's just extremely pathetic and he doesn't own up to anything. And it's just like, if you guys seen any of my other videos talking about him, it's just a copy and paste. So basically the whole gist of it is he brings up generation stuff. Like, like back in my day, I used to be outside and playing and I'm so glad I grew up in that generation. And he just goes on this like boomer rant and it makes no sense. And then he says, oh, this young generation just tries to get views and, and harass people in public, obviously referring Stidion. But it's like, it, it's crazy. Cause it's like, it, it literally makes no sense. Cause he is chronically online to this day. He's online constantly. So I don't know why he's bringing up this generational stuff and has to like do this boomer talk. You know what I mean? As if it's relatable. And then he also like tries to paint himself as the victim, pretty much saying, oh, Gideon met, like, saw me at the dialysis center and I could have fucking died and he chased me around town and I literally could have dropped dead and he wouldn't even have cared. He doesn't bring up the fact that they had message logs. They had DMs from a real life girl who came out as well. He doesn't message Kayla once. The only time he's talked about Kayla so far is when he was like throwing shade at her on Twitter, calling her like a skank hoe who's like, you know, using him and stuff like that. So he admitted that he knows who Kayla was and is, you know what I mean? But he doesn't bring it up at all because he knows that, you know, it will paint him bad even to his brain dead viewers, pretty much saying, oh, Gideon's only doing this for clout, only doing it for views. You know, it's it's exactly how his fan base is reacting to this situation. So obviously, G or, uh, EDP is going to be the exact same. His fans are literally him. But yeah, anyways, he basically will just uh, demise himself the entire time. Victim blame. He brings up generation stuff. You know what I mean? He lies through his ass. You know, he talks about how he's actually currently getting therapy. You know what I mean? He's like, everything doesn't need to be online. Maybe I am seeking a counselor behind the scenes. Well, if even if you are, that counselor sucks at their job because you clearly are still doing the same shit to this day, which you can't bring up because that'll debunk your whole entire fucking thing. You can't even bring up Kayla because you know that you're in the wrong. And it's only a matter of time. He's literally biting minutes right now. It's only a matter of time before he gets caught and, and actually arrested. You know what I mean? The police have all the messages, all the FaceTimes, all the DMs. He is screwed. And if the police actually doesn't pursue charges, there's going to be a massive uproar. You know what I mean? It's it's clear as day what he's doing and what he has done. 
And I feel like the police should not drop the ball on this because it is unreal. But yeah, any, anyways, that's all I really want to talk about. Um, it's just sad. It's just pathetic. And I hope to God this is the last video he's going to make before he actually is arrested. Um, so fingers crossed. But anyways, that's my video. If you guys want to go watch this video, I do suggest you wait a little bit longer until All Access releases the video or uh, archives or whatever because it will be uploaded on YouTube. And I'm sure Jideon will probably react to it. So I would wait for that just so he doesn't get any more views on his website. You know what I mean? So yeah. Anyways, that's all I really want to talk about. If you guys like this video, leave a like, subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys. Yeah,